All right, guys, welcome back. Um, what I want to share with you today is the uh, Revell 1958 Chevy Impala. And uh, this is my uh, buddy build final with uh, Tommy Moore. He, um, he built a 58 and I built a 58, kind of as a buddy build. So uh, it's finished now, and I thought I'd show you what i uh, done here. Um, I knew it was going to be some kind of a custom, uh, preferably a 60s uh, style, very early 70s style lowrider. So uh, that's what I end up building. And um, I kind of build models the way, if I had the real car, how I would like it to look. And that's what I did here. And uh, the first thing I did was I shaved off all that extra chrome that went up here and uh, up here on the headlights, on top of the headlights, there's a little chrome piece in there. Shaved the door handles and the uh, V off the hood and off the trunk, as you can see back here. Um, added the uh, individual's car club plaque and the uh, Astral Supremes from um, Gavin over at uh, Lowrider Model Car Parts. And uh, he, he's got a lot of cool, cool parts. If you're looking for uh, accessories to uh, like old Chevys and um, just Lowrider type stuff, that's the place to go. Um, Lowrider Model Car Parts, I'll, uh, I'll leave a link in the description box where you can go by and see his stuff but um yeah this is it it's got the uh the little donut steering wheel in there uh pearl white interior i used the uh, decals for the uh interior inserts that came with the kit it's got the um silver metal flake roof candy purple uh bottom and just a slight gradation of that design down through the center i was originally going to build some um uh bellflower pipes for it but uh and i did build a set and when i put them on there i realized well i've got a pipe here and a pipe here so i had four pipes in the back so i thought nah i'm not going to run those after all so i didn't and uh and then i thought well maybe i'll uh do a set of rabbit ears on it but I didn't have like a really good clear piece of plastic or even a good uh, tinted piece of plastic to make a side window. Because you got to put those rabbit ears, you got to mount them to something. And they mount actually to the window and not the uh, drip rail like some people think. Um, let me pull the uh, hood off and I'll show you the motor. There's the motor that came with the kit. It's the uh, big um, 348, I think it is. And yeah, did a little bit of extra detail to it. Put the um, gas line and the spark plug wires, of course. And then a uh, little copper tubing coming off the master cylinder. And a uh, little bit of paintwork in there. All in all, it's a pretty cool kit. Um, yeah, but that's my, that's my uh, buddy build final. It's the first buddy build I've been in. And uh, I'm glad to have gotten it done. So um, I can chalk this one off. Um, you know, I told you guys I kind of got into these 64 scale cars. And what I've been kind of doing is I'll get a stock uh, 64 scale car like this one, which was stock. And uh, I'll tear it apart, repaint it, redo it such as this car here, I uh, stripped the paint off and repainted it, changed the wheels and tires on it, and uh, painted the interior white and the front spoiler and bumpers white, along with the uh, rear spoiler. A lot of fun to do, these little cars, and uh, they're quick and they're fast, and I can work on them in between the stuff out in the garage. And I think the next one I'm going to do is this little Vega. And uh, I'm gonna put a set of uh, fat tires on the back. I'm gonna put this um, blown motor out of the uh, Beatnik Bandit. I'm gonna put it popping through that hood. And uh, when I do, I'll bring it back and I'll show it to you guys. 
But um, yeah, just wanted to give you a, a look at the uh, finish of the uh, buddy build. Um, hope you guys like it. If you would, give me a like, leave me a comment, and uh, sub me if you haven't. And I will see you guys on the next one. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.